going to start this with a size 12 jig hook and a 1 8 tungsten gold bead. I'm going to use olive dyed peacock or yeah, pheasant tail sorry not peacock pheasant tail all right we're going to make the tail the length of the hook and then we're going to wrap the rest of the the fibers you got about like six fibers there you're going to tie the rest back and use that to wrap the body later. I'm going to tie in some fine gold wire to work, uh, act as a rib in this fly. Gonna rest, wrap the rest of them uh, pheasant tail fibers forward, right up to the bead, and tie them off. Now you're gonna wrap the golden wire, the fine gold wire, the opposite direction you wrap the uh, fibers because that'll trap them down, make the fly more durable, and the gold wire will stick out better. This video is brought to you by Young's Taxidermy. Go check them out for all your taxidermy needs. Thank you very much for considering them.
We're going to use this brown UV dubbing and we're going to kind of make a collar behind the soft hackle. We're going to make it really small, not very sparse dubbing. Okay, this is the only soft hackle I could find. All my soft hackles are too long. You don't want these feathers to stick out too much past the bend of the hook. So you want to take this feather and you want to bend the uh, fibers back and strip most of them off. Except for the ones that are long, or short enough. Then you want to bend them back towards the stem of the hook. So you just have a little teeny like triangle at the end of the tip of the feather. And you want to leave a little bit of that on and cut this feather off. Because you're going to be wrapping it backwards to the normal hackle from the tip to the base of the stem on the hook. Now while you're wrapping this around the, the, the hook, you want to bend them fibers back towards the tail of the fly. You want to kind of push them back and keep them going backwards and not forward as you wrap the feather around the hook. What I'm going to do is I'm going to hold that bare stem in one hand and wrap it with the and tie it down with some thread wraps and then I'll go down and tie it down with like a couple four or five thread wraps to hold it down and then cut it off. I'm gonna pull them hackles back and kind of tie them down with some thread wraps so that they're facing all back. Oh man, I'm glad to bring you this video. These are gonna be deadly on the end of your, your rod. Um, welcome to history. I never tied a soft tackle on my channel. I'm gonna be getting into more soft tackles and more different variety of flies so check out the other videos above me and like
and subscribe to this channel. Over 50% of you people who are watching this video haven't subscribed yet. Please go and subscribe. Help us out. You have a good day. Keep your lines wet out of trees and only give them fish. A sore lip.